Hey guys, it's me, the Haunted Wolf 12 here, and today we're going to be doing another unboxing on another inflatable. This time, it's not on an Amazon sale inflatable. This time, it's a brand new 2023 inflatable. And it's one that's um, dividing a lot of people. It causes a lot of dividing opinions. A lot of people don't like it. Um, some people do. I do like it. I think it's cute. I think it's really cool, and we don't get werewolves ever, and obviously, as I just said that, you could probably guess this is the Target Werewolf. If you can read that label, really small, but it says it. So that is what we'll be opening today, and I guess without further ado, I'll just go ahead and do it. As you can see, this is how the cases come in the Target warehouse, so they just shove the whole thing in another box, a larger box than this one. So, three boxes total. Pretty unnecessary, but still nice, I guess. I know a lot of people are making fun of the design, but I think Target's design is, well, their uh, character designs are cute and they're neat. Ne not everything needs to be scary. Some things can be kid-friendly and cute and just fun, whimsical. And as you can see right there, it says LED animated inflatable werewolf. So we'll get the main box out of the carton box. And there we have it. He has a sound box and the head turns, which is pretty impressive. Sound boxes have been pretty limited in recent years and especially you don't see him on a character that's only six feet tall so yeah regardless of if you like the design or not you have to admit that's pretty impressive they gave a six foot character a base fan a sound box and animation also if you're wondering I did not pay the $100 retail I paid $80 because I have I had a coupon for being a college student. So, better than paying 100 because, yeah, I'm, I'm... Although I do enjoy the design, I disagree with the people hating on it. Um, I will say I don't think it's worth $100. So, 80 is much better than 100 But, anyway, here he is. And as you can see, he has the white packaging instead of clear like all the other new inflatables this year have. So without further ado, I'm going to get him out of the box and get him inflated. There he is. Larger than I was expecting. And he's really loud. I'm sure he has volume control. I could change. But... Yeah, I'm actually pretty happy with him. I'm kind of weirded out that the color is red. I thought it was going to be brown. But, yeah, overall he's really neat. 